The main advantage of any CAD system is the ability to create and modify 2D and 3D geometric entities quickly and accurately. Most CAD systems provide a variety of object construction and editing tools, and so far we've only talked about circle, line, and trim. We're going to explore a few more using our object snap toolbar so you can more quickly recreate drawings. The first of which is going to be bisecting a line or an arc. So to start, let's create an arbitrary arc at any angle and create a line to connect the two endpoints of the arc. So I'll start with my arc. And I'll go back and connect the two endpoints with a line. Before we go any further, make sure that your dynamic input is switched on, which means the light blue light should be lit up, and that you have your object snap toolbar visible. If you do not have your object snap toolbar, it is located under tools, toolbars, AutoCAD, Object Snap. Next, we're going to select Line from the Draw Toolbar and Snap to Perpendicular from our Object Snap Toolbar. We can select anywhere on the line that we drew and notice that as I move my cursor and the graphics window, it will stay perpendicular to the line whether it is touching it or not. Go ahead and select an arbitrary point above the line. Right click and select enter. Now we're going to use move. Select move from your modify toolbar. Select the line we just drew, and you can use your spacebar or right click to confirm the selection. Now note your message says specify base point. AutoCAD wants us to select a reference point as the base point for moving the selected object. On your Object Snap Toolbar, select Snap to Endpoint, and we're going to choose the end of the line that's closest to this intersection. Notice that that is now connected to my cursor, and we're going to reposition it using our object snap toolbar and the snap to midpoint option. On your arc, there should be a triangle displayed for the midpoint. Snap that into place and you've just completed the first task. On your own, without my instruction, repeat the process to move this perpendicular line to the midpoint of this line. 